Greetings. Due to camera failure, I didn't know that uh, my storage was full. So I could not upload the video that was recorded when completing the bag. So we are going to be using this other bag which is similar so we can see the process of finishing our tote bag so um i'm not gonna waste your time talking too much let's dive in Cutting the zipper closure. Now you can go ahead and design yours any way you want it. But this is how we do ours at Promega Leather. We have two ways. This zipper closure. And this take note of this notches here in the middle they're gonna come in handy when we'll be putting the zipper closure or the zipper keeper in place now we'll cut another strip of leather this is gonna be our secondary which will be underneath this one so I'm gonna take off this now now I'm going to glue apply contact cement on this one one part only to tack both together so we can go ahead and cut out the space for the zipper that will hold this in place so both will be exact measurement When bonding two pieces of leather together, it is advisable to not pull. Don't stretch the leather. So now we're gonna cut. Mark out holes to punch.
straps. Now we're going to trim to size. Now the next step will be to measure the top in order to make our lining and this is the way I do it. A strip of paper and I'm going to clamp that all around the bag. Just like that. This is this was my start. This was my starting point, or is my starting point. And what I did, I made half an inch overlap for a seam. So I went ahead and measured that. So whatever your measured your measurement is, you're going to divide that by two. And at this stage, you can make a pattern for your lining. For purpose of this video, I'm not going to do a pattern for the lining, but I will do another video on doing a pattern for lining. So I did my measurements and draw my lines. I'm just gonna cut directly on the pattern. My bad, I'm gonna cut directly on the lining. And marked all around this. Now I'm going to cut an opening, which is not up to the size of my zipper keeper, it will be smaller.
now we are going to we are going to stitch both sides of the corset going to put them together So um, we dropped in the lining, but we're still not done. That's how it will look inside. One slip pocket in the back, zippered, and two extra large slip pockets inside. So these are like on the front and the slip pocket the zippered slip pocket is at the back.
with this we've come to the end of this this segment segment of the series if you are new to our channel please subscribe share to other leather crafters let's pass it on let's pass the skills we learn every day let's pass it on thank you very much um the last uh segment of this series will be up by this evening until then peace